Well, here's the second part of K-San. Um, here, thanks to the guys who asked for it after seeing the first part. And in the first part, we ended up getting up to the bit that went like this. And I think I showed it to you with that top note in. So... Now we sort of go back to where we were at the start. And what we're going to do is bring this one down and just play the other three all along. So, like that. Left hand comes down to the C here. And all we do is move the thumb up. So, we switch from here to here in the left and thumb up. Now we do this. Slow motion. Thumb up, third finger down. Up to speed. And then finally down to a G here. So that whole section goes something like this. Now, I reckon it works best to put the ring finger on the G here, because you're going to go... And in the right hand, same spot, thumb. Those two. leaving the thumb where it is. So when you put all that together you get... Back to a, a C chord. standard position and then moving these two down again. And then it's something like this. So it's starting to get a little bit more complicated than the first one. Let's do all of that again. And now we're almost to the, the centre part of the intro, when everything drops down and a, a few little guitars come in. From the top. Now we've got to move everything down to here. We're centering on these Ds, D being the white note in the middle of the two black ones. And again, we're just going to move these two fingers up. So we're going to go... So that's, that's a good thing to practice doing. to look for this finger on the D again. And we just drop the top one down one. So we've got... Now, it's kind of like doing the first round again, an octave lower, but not quite. When we did the first round, we are up here. So you might think the second round would be... All the same positions, but just down an octave. It's actually not quite like that. This, I take this bottom note and put it up there. So it actually plays here. So to launch into our next bit, it's an E minor chord, if you're interested. K7. 
goes like this. I'll just show you what I did there. I took that E minor chord and moved those two down. And the left hand, of course. Back to a C chord. And this is the bit I love playing. There's all your notes. Now all I'm going to do is move this one and this one up one, like that. Move those two back down one. And to play it we do this. I'll do that again real slow-mo. And then we repeat all of that. Back into here. And now we are nearly finished. This is the same as before. And then the band comes in and you just keep going on those chords. Have fun.